we're going to show you how easy it is to use the play design of series. Moving a player is as simple as dragging them on the field. Drawing a route is as simple as right clicking on the player, choosing the type of route you want, and simply clicking the line. You can even edit the route by dragging the points of the route to where you want them. Very simple to do. If you want to draw a pass, you simply take a player and start them with the ball. And I'm going to end a player with the ball. And the pass line simply draws. One of the great features of the Play Designer series is this properties window. The ability to change labels, the depth chart, styles of the line, the zone settings, <coughs> and the ball settings. Labeling a player is as simple as giving them a label. And you can even turn the graphic off and the label becomes the graphic, a feature that a lot of our coaches have asked for. Setting a read route, I'll show you how this works, is as simple as marking a read and you see the quarterback gets there. If I want to mark a read on another player, I simply click. I do the same thing. Ability to show the progressions that a quarterback makes. A new feature of our designer series is the learning mode. The ability to turn a play off, basically, and turn the lights on certain players. This is great for teaching, great for coaches, and really great for youth football, even high school football, to really focus on teaching the play. You could save these plays to a video file, post them on YouTube, you could print them to a PDF, save them, of course, and continue to edit them. There are more demos at our Help Center. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy Play Designer Series 2011.